welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make these custom um, zombie minifigures and zombie survivor minifigures. So I already have one more safe house but I just first wanted to film this one. So we're first going to start off with the uh, survivors. So yes uh, we have uh, so we're going to start off with this dude, which is sweating, <laughs> so funny. Okay, to make him, you're going to need these white pants, and this construction worker torso. Uh, so yeah, and you're going to need this sweating head. He's sweating because he's scared, I think. Yeah, and you're also going to give him a hat, so he looks like this. Then we're going to give him this bag with money inside, a coin. So he's going to need money. Uh, so yeah, we're just going to put him, give him this bag full of money, yeah. And uh, we're just going to give him a gun because... He needs to be protected, so we're going to give him a good gun, I think it's a sniper, sniper or something else, yeah. So, this is our guy, I hope you liked it, uh, so yeah, on to our next is the medic dude. So, he's so cool, um, he has this bandage, uh, so if someone gets like a cut he just wraps uh, the guy so yeah he's a cool guy and he has a knife and he has a bag so yeah these also are used for toilet paper uh, but i'm just right now using it for uh bandages so yeah so so to make this guy you're going to first need these regular pants, uh, dark blue jeans, pants, yeah, and uh, then you're going to take this torso, uh, so yeah, this torso, uh, I've given him this knife, and I've given him a bandage, so it just fits on like that, and he has a knife. He has a bag, and yeah, we're going to just put it just like that. Then you're going to need one more of this cylinder piece, and we're going to put it on the back, on the backpack. Uh, and we're going to get him this cool old dude head. So he's kind of funny. He has mustache. He's like, oh man, what did do? <laughs> So, yeah, it's good for a medic. The medic is very cool, I guess. Yeah, and here it is. So, I'm going to... I just made these minifigures, but in the future, if I make more minifigures like this, I will film a video of them. So, like part two. Uh, so, yeah. On to our next one is the boss. So, yeah. He's the boss. And I really love him, so yeah. To make him, you're going, wait, if so, he has this cool gun. You can see right there. I don't know what it's called, because I don't play with guns. I don't like guns, but I really love Lego guns, so yeah. Uh, and here we have this cowboy hat. Let's give him, he looks very cool, and yeah, he's... Very cool. And he has a Ninjago face. Uh, so, yeah. So, to make him, guys, you're going to need these jeans. Uh, so, yeah. Jeans. <laughs> so, they're like... Uh, they're like gray, bluish gray, or something like that. But 
I don't know really how to call them. Then you're going to need this torso. Well, actually, this torso is not like this. You're going to, uh, you'll probably have this torso with the dark arms, uh, dark blue arms. But I've, uh, so took out the dark blue arms and add these arms, which doesn't have anything on it. So, yeah, I just broke this. So I'm just going to fix it. Okay, so I fixed it, uh, I'm just going to put it there, the torso, and we're going to get this Ninjago face. We'll say, what is this guy? Is it a robot or what is this? But we're going to use this face. I really, really love this face, but Lego can make without this face, so only one face, this face. This face is so cool, so... When you look from the back when you put the hat, so we're going to just put a cowboy hat. So yeah, and we're going to give him a gun. Uh, it doesn't have to be, the gun doesn't have to be like this. It can be under gun, other guns. Uh, so yeah, I like this gun. It fits in minifigures so cool. So yeah, uh, and that's our guy. So he has this... Ninjago face under you can see when he gets angry he'll probably turn into a robot So yeah sound effects I love them uh, So on to our next guy is my favorite dude uh, I call him James I don't know why but I really love him So he has this cool gun I don't know what's called so if someone knows what these guns are called, uh, please type them down below so I can know too. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I didn't do any research on this these guns, and yeah. So uh, he has uh, to make this guy. You're going to need these pants. I really love these pants. So you're just going to put them right there. It has pockets. So yeah, and you're going to need this torso. You can find it in some Lego City sets. Uh, actually, I have lots of Lego uh, because when I was, I don't know, four years old or what, I bought my first Lego set, then I bought more, 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 more. So now I have like a bunch of Lego, lots of, lots of. It's not a bunch of. So yeah, you're going to need this smiling face. Hey, dude. Uh, so and you're going to put this hair. So yeah, it can be any hair. I just like this guy. I like. Uh, I just put all the torsos and the pants and the faces and the you know the guns and the faces I like and put it all together and made this minifigure. So I really like all of his stuff. So yeah, we're just going to put him aside and onto our next is is this dude. So he's the, just a pilot. I really like him. Uh, so we're just going to build him. So to build him, you're going to need these legs. Uh, so it can be any blue legs. Or, yeah, I'm just going to use these ones. So and then you're going to get this police torso well uh, it doesn't have to be a police one but i use the police one so it's probably a survivor police survivor so we're just going to put him right there he has a normal star wars gun and uh, a shotgun uh, so yeah extra gun he has two guns and we're going to give him this face hey focus on the face yeah, and so, uh, we're going to give him a pilot helmet and a face, so it can be any face. I'm using this, uh, kind of angry face. He's a bit angry about the zombies. So, guys, I think that was the last guy, so, uh, now we're going to do the zombies. So, wait, first, let me show this guy. Yeah, so he's just like that. He has this police sign on the back. Printing. Yeah, he has lots of printings. I like him. Oh, guys, on to... Hi, guys. Uh, so what? Why did I say hi? 
sorry. So, uh, yeah, yeah, you were already there. You know me. Okay, uh, so we have this dude. Um, and when making these zombie minifigures, you will need uh, this plastic scene. Uh, plastic scene. It's really cool. It's like a dough, but it doesn't get dry. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to pause the video and come back when I get it because I want to show you how it looks like. Okay, guys, I've got it. So, it looks like... Wait, where is it? It's here. So, it looks like this. So, let me just open the package. It has these plastic scenes inside. But when you first buy it, it doesn't look like this. So, I just used and put it right there. So, don't mind that. It, it has actually lots of colors, but I finished uh, some of the colors. So, yeah, it's so cool. It's like dough, as you can see. It's so cool. So, I'm just showing you if you don't know. If you know this part, so if you know plasticine, just uh, skip these parts because they're going to be boring for you, I guess. Uh, so, yeah, uh, I used lots of these colors to make these guys. Uh, so, yeah, and to build him, you're going to need a fire fire leg a uh, fire dude leg so firefighter leg fireman leg so yeah i talked a lot so we're just going to put it right right there so i want to make it look like it's like ripped off his pants is ripped off it is so i put some plasticine black plasticine here so his pants is ripped off as you can see here we can see his butt. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I just couldn't put there because I was scared that it will go in there and never come back. So yeah, I've used a normal gray leg. So I took out the this part. So yeah. And I've put this and put some plasticine here. Uh, I don't right now have black in this set. So actually I had... But I, I think I used all of it. So yeah, we're just going to need this. Well, if you like your Legos, but uh, you can, uh, so you can actually draw on them, but I don't want to. Because maybe in the future I would decide to, you know, take these out. So I'm using these. And uh, for the torso, we're going to take this torso. It's so simple. Just take it. Fire farter. Mm, fire farter? Sorry, firefighter uh, torso, then put some uh, gray plasticine here, then take this uh, oxygen tank and put some black plasticine here, so it's like burned, uh, and here we ha so I'm using some gray for the skin because, so he's like burned while he was trying to save some people. He got burned and he turned into a zombie. So I don't really have this gray head. So I just put some uh, gray plasticine on the head. And I have give him this axe. Wanted to give him. So yeah, I've just put that. And so on to our next zombie is, is Darth Vader. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> so yeah, um... I've just give him the, you know, the mask of Darth Vader and I've just chopped off some legs and put some uh, plasticine here. So yeah, some uh, blood, bloody, <laughs> uh, so some red plasticine. So he's bloody guy. It's very simple to make him. You're just going to need these. Wait, I just... Why? Oh my. Okay, guys, sorry about this. Uh, yeah, you're just going to need these pants. Uh, and you're going to rip off one of the leg and put some red plasticine. You don't have to, but you can. Uh, it looks much more better. So, yeah, and you're going to need a torso with one arm missing. And you're going to put some plasticine uh, 
Uh, we have some blood here. I put some blood and put a lightsaber right there. So I'm just going to put it right there. So yeah, and we're going to get this head. Uh, or we're going to get first this dude. I don't know what it's called, so yeah, it can be anything. So yeah, we're going to get this mask and put it right there. I just put a black um, black head inside it. So yeah, and uh, I hope you liked it. It's so cool. So on to our next is a stormtrooper. So he's just like a stormtrooper, which is dead. So he died in a war. Star Wars. War, war, war. Yeah, so we're just going to uh, get him. Wait, what? It's not a zombie face because I don't have one. So I just use the normal face. Uh, whatever. So we're just going to remove the... We're going to get the legs and we're going to put some plasticine over there and rip off one leg. And we're going to get this uh, kind of torso. So yeah. We're going to uh, put. Oops. Uh, yeah. We're going to put this torso over there, and I've just ripped one of the hands off and put some blood over there on the arm and on the tubby <laughs> tummy. And we're going to get this stormtrooper helmet with a normal head inside. So yeah, we're we're also going to put some blood, plasticine blood, in, on top of the helmet so it looks like this. So, yeah, so it looks, I think, very cool. So I'm just going to put him aside. Our next minifigure is very, very creepy. So, yeah, uh, you might see him in my zombie safe house number part two. So the garage safe house, Octon garage safe house. But I've changed his face to, you know, like the... Um, skeleton face so yeah and here uh, I've just done a few things I took off the head put it right there with the plasticine stick it uh, and took off the arm and put it right there so there's n not much thing we're just going to get these legs and put the torso on this police torso I think it's the same as you can see yeah there it's the same torso I really like him, uh, so yeah, he's very scary and funny, uh, so we're going to put him aside. So, on to our next is this minifigure uh, here. We're, uh, we are not going to use any plasticine, so you can be just, you can just use this uh, pants, and you're going to rip one of the legs, uh, so you're going to get him a torso, which no hand and no arm uh, so you're going to put it just right there and you're going to get this burned face actually this is from the collectible minifigure series so i'm just going to put it right there white it can be any white head because i want him to look like burned so we're going to put this normal basic hat this was our last minifigure Hope you liked the video guys. If you liked, please hit the like button and don't forget to follow me on Flickr. Uh, yeah, and please like, subscribe. I said those. Uh, wait, uh, he doesn't have this. So I'm just going to put all the minifigures in one place. So I'm just putting, uh, doing this very fast. So see you soon. Bye.